Hey guys, Arcade Adam back with another video. I'm gonna do a quick tutorial today on Omega now that we've released a beta. So get your notepad ready. All right, guys, I'm going to show you what I'm talking about first. I'm, I'm going to show you what I'm talking about, and then I'm going to show you how to fix it. So this is Metal Slug. Can you guys see what I'm seeing? Yeah. Um, it's not a good screen right now, but the white screen, you can see the game goes all the way to these bezels we got. So this is Bezel Project Bezels, and Omega has BGFX main scan lines turned on. That's a debate for another video. But what I'm talking about is when the screen gets bright enough, you can see, see how it goes all the way to the edge? Give it a nice clean look. Now that's not how it came. Like, and you guys correct me if I'm wrong, maybe there's somebody smarter in the comments that can tell me a better way to fix this, but when I first fired up Metal Slug, it looked like Metal Slug 2. So let me show you what it looks like stock. And maybe there's a way to modify these more, but I uh, know this is a bad example. Oh, oh, here we go. See how the white doesn't go all the way to the edges when we get a, hold on, we'll wait for a brighter screen. Um, got metal slug you're not helping me <laughs> but anyway see how there's a big black border here and it should go all the way to the actual bezel built into the game see this gap right there i know it's a small thing but now that we got these nice beautiful scan lines the way they should be looking and you can see between the bezel and the game itself how it looks let me show you how to fix this real quick so you're going to go into your tab menu on main you're going to go to the slider controls and there is a screen horizontal stretch about three quarters of the way down on the top. And then you're just gonna stretch this out till about 1.03, oh, this one takes a little more. 1.03 was Metal Slug 1, this one likes 1.05, in my opinion. We'll wait for another bright screen, see how it goes? You got just a tiny little black edge, and then you can just hit escape twice. And this is before you even get into the game, it's still playing the attract screen. And you'll see when we have the lighter background, see how it goes all the way to the edge now? That's, in my opinion, that's just a cleaner look. Now, maybe you guys know how to modify this for all the games, because that's a per game setting. So you're gonna have to launch up your favorite games and edit that yourself, but it's real simple. Here, I'll do it again. We'll do Metal Slug 3. Um, and I know it, it's gonna be a not accurate stretch, but it's so minute, in my opinion, it's worth it just to get the full experience um <clears throat> so this one should be the same thing see the boot screen actually goes to the edge but in the game it's not and like i said maybe someone smarter than me can comment down below and let me know why that is but same thing tab menu slider controls see this one's a little thicker even it looks like and we'll go horizontal stretch and this one's gonna oh it's about the same 1.05 Four, in my opinion, because you still want a little bit of an edge, because that was how CRTs looked, or how I remember them looking. And that's it. You just hit escape. You can coin up, get in the game. Doesn't affect anything. Sure, mathematically, you're applying a wider stretch to the game itself, but like I said, it's worth it to not have pixel accurate integer scaling to get that rid of that black border. So. That's my quick one. Hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.